Hello everybody and welcome back to another video here on the channel. Uh, it's been a while. Um, had been very busy recently, but uh, hopefully that's looking to change here in the future. Um, unfortunately for us, RP isn't a thing anymore, but I am here in uh, Red River Roleplay and hopefully you're going to see a lot more content come from this and just hopefully to just bring the best content I can for you guys. But like I said, just here having a good time. And uh, yeah, this first uh, traffic stop that I was, was playing right now is about to start. Is uh, just you need is an additional 32. Uh, but uh, yeah, as always, put the website link in the description of this video if you guys want to join. Uh, we love to have you all, and we'll see you around. Yeah, he was cooking pretty good down the interstate. Changed uh, lanes in the middle of the intersection crossroad there. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm just stopping him. Do a Basic check on his uh, logs and stuff. Bickered. Now I'll let you be it. I'm just here for support. Yeah, I figured you'd uh, want something to do. You've been sitting there watching that damn football game for too long. <laughs> How you doing? Good afternoon. How you doing? Well, do me a favor. Shut the truck off. Grab your paperwork, your logbook, your medical card, all that good, good jazz, and uh, hop down. Come back here and speak with me. Oh, I, I want to go ahead and let you know now. I do have a firearm on me. All right, where's that firearm located? It's gonna be on my right hip. In, in, right, you don't reach for yours. All right, you don't reach for yours. I don't reach for mine. Deal. Sounds good. All right, and, let's walk uh, back as, here. As this truck is not used for commercial means, uh, if, if if you look, it it's blends in a little bit too much with the color, but it's got not for hire on the sleeper. It's not a commercial vehicle. It's for recreational use. Okay, and what recreational use is that? Well, well I go camping in this truck. All right. You got your driver's license? I do. Uh, it is in my. It is right above my left titty and my coveralls. Can I reach for it? Like I said, as long as you don't reach for your firearm, I don't reach for mine. All right. There you go. Uh, what's the name on that? It's in. That's well, gonna be, it, you know, uh, it, it's gonna be Jim Baker. All right, Mr. Baker. All right. So the reason for the reason I'm stopping you is, nope. um, the truck is, you know, in my eyes, you know, a commercial vehicle. Uh, I'm gonna have to do a little bit of research real quick to make sure that you know. This this is out of the parameters of a commercial vehicle. Um, however, that's the reason I'm stopping you, as well as the lane change in the middle of the intersection when you cross Joshua. That is still considered an intersection. You can't change lanes right there. Well, okay. well, sir, I don't mean to argue with you, but I changed lanes before I got to the intersection. I was at least about sixty foot before the intersection before I merged into the primary lane of travel. All right. Well, I'm not going to argue with you right now. So hang tight with this other trooper, and I'll be right back with you in a few minutes, okay? Yeah, sure. All right. Hey, hey, officer, you mind if I reach in there and grab my water? Yeah, you're good. That's where you headed. All right, well, I'm, a, I'm heading down. Oh, well, I'm heading down there to Los Santos. To the Joe built dealer, I'm gonna have them uh, do an oil change, and there's mm -hmm. something wrong. You know, there's, there's, there's a knocking inside of my engine. Yeah. Where are you coming from? I'm coming from the Palita Bay. All right. So, do you is this your just where you live? No, sir. This is what what most people would call a RV. Yeah. No, but, I, uh, I, I heard what you were saying. I just didn't know if you lived here. I used no, to sir. I, I, this isn't my full living. Okay. You don't get too cramped. You didn't ever think a RV might be a little bit more spacious? No, sir. This is, this is all that I need. Mm, understandable. I mean, if Mr. you... Mr. Baker. Whatever works for you. Ever since Debbie passed away. 
Oh. Yes, right. sir. How can I help you? All right. So, unfortunately, you are false. Just because it says "not for hire" on the side of the vehicle does not exclude it from being a commercial vehicle. Okay. Under Texas state law, Penal Code 621.001-1 defines a commercial motor vehicle as a motor vehicle designed or used for transportation of property or goods for delivery. This truck is designed for transportation of goods for delivery. Okay, <laughs> Therefore, it is considered a commercial vehicle. I do see that you have a commercial driver's license on you. That also requires you to have a logbook on you at all times. Okay. Well, sir, I was speaking with the lady down there, the DPS uh, driver license office, and she was saying that I didn't need need one of them. Yeah. So, I, as I said, okay, the legal definition for a commercial vehicle in the state of Texas under Texas Law six twenty one dash zero zero one dash one defines a, com a commercial vehicle as a motor vehicle designed or used for transportation of property or delivery. Okay, This truck is designed for transportation of property. All right, It also meets the GVWR of a commercial vehicle, therefore it is classified as one under Texas state law. Okay. So do you have a log book on you at all or no? Well, sir, I, 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 again, I was told by the lady down there at the DPS office, I don't need a log book to operate this. Okay. Or, you were told, yeah, I don't you were told to... incorrectly. All right. So, with that being said, I'm going to need you to hang tight. And 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 I'm pretty sure if I'm traveling less than 100 miles, either way, I don't have to run a log book. Well, where are you coming I'm, from? I'm coming from Palita Bay. And where are you going? I'm going down there north of Vinewood. Okay, that's more than 100 miles right there. No, sir. It's it's about eighty uh, miles. Yeah. It's it's eighty miles from here to Palito Bay. I think you're getting your uh, your mileage wrong. It's less than eighty miles, or it's eighty miles as the bird flies. No, sir. It's it's but, about eighty miles to North Vinewood from Palito Bay, from where I started. That's what I'm getting off of my. That's what I'm getting off of my internet map. All right, go ahead and hang tight here. Trooper, you want to come over here and speak to me for a minute? Okay. Sit tight, man. Just uh, don't make some movements. I have uh, an individual that was apparently robbed and knocked down zip tied. Uh, so can I go at least one of I'll respond to that. Uh, I didn't even hear it. My radio didn't go off for some reason. 212, you can show me 17. I'll be, uh, 17. I'll be uh, back in radio second. All right, what uh, what was that call? Uh, somebody got zip tied. I don't know. I'll be back oh. radio. Oh, uh, okay. Oh. Yeah, I'll let him loose and I'll route for that. Let me know a location. Too far. Okay, and you said so. You said the one individual had a two-door sports car, black sides, blue sides, and like a black like hood, and blue black sides. spoiler on the back. I'm gonna talk to my officer real quick, kind of let him know what's going on. Yeah. Or actually, I'm pretty sure he knows more. Evening. Sir. Nope. <laughs> no. <laughs> Sorry, I got here. sidetracked. No, you're, you're all good. So, uh, initial 911 call was this individual made a Siri 911 call. Uh, they were uh, said that they were knocked out, zip tied, and they were robbed. Uh, apparently, yeah. this person's name is Grayson Gavarino. Uh, birthday will be March 5th, 2002. He said two people robbed him. Uh, both of the, uh, both of them were wearing uh, all black hoodies. They were all black, black hoodies. One was possibly wearing the vest that I'm wearing right now. Uh, mm. And then one of them was a, was driving a two-door sports car. And I was just about to get the description of the second vehicle that was involved uh, for the perpetrator. Mm hmm all right so this one back up just in case because i don't know if, if they're going to come back and try to do something to this individual or, or if anything with yeah. this individual in general yeah so i'm going to get the rest of the story uh do you want to run his name real quick what's his name 
It's going to be Grayson Galvarino. You got an ID. Uh, let me see. I got it right here. Okay. All right, I'll run it. Is this the guy that it. is this the guy that you have stopped right here? The guy in front of us. Yeah, yeah, Grayson Galvarino is going to be the guy that I have in front of us. Uh, he's the victim of the crime. Okay. I just want to run a background just in case. All right. All right so it's going to be two door, like both of them are going to be two door sports cars. Yeah, for the most part. But the other one was just like completely all black. Black, bluish. Forty-two twenty. I'm gonna be out on a traffic stop with a red Porsche. I also had a secondary vehicle, high rates of speed, stop down thirteen, coming up to the Sandy Shores exit, recklessly driving there, pit maneuvering each other. If I can have somebody on the aisle for that. So you said like bluish pink lights, right? Like at least around it. Yeah, like the outer part of it. It's kind of. I guess you could say like an accent. I guess. You're saying that these individuals, like, kind of. It would have seemed initiated a traffic stop on you. The first one seemed it. That's what it seemed like. That's why I pulled over because I was thinking, this guy's got a blue car and like, I don't know what you guys drive, so I was thinking maybe he was a cop, and I figured I would like try it as opposed to like getting a charge for running against me, because I don't need that. Um. Gonna be southbound Route 13, taking the Sandy Shores exit. Red two-door Porsche. Right, 4220. I got. There's now a second Porsche. It'll be northbound Panorama Drive. Now the red Porsche is my primary. He's taking Route 68. Route 68 westbound. I want to be down here at 247. Do you think I should stay here or try to get spikes? 10-4. Uh, they're gonna be coming up quick. They're I'm, uh, they're pulling on me fast. I'm in a Tahoe. I'm at Still continuing as far as I can tell. I'm at Pass. I can. I just saw brake lights briefly. They're still continuing. Which one is the it's primary be one? Red Porsche. The other one is a secondary. They were both street racing I and reckless them. driving. They're too fast. They're continuing down. Brake lights. I believe they're taking a right onto Joshua. Joshua. Yeah, they're too fast. Oh, uh, near the satellite, near the satellite. Civilian that is down, and we have a car that's between the uh, satellite dishes. This might be one of the vehicles that uh, we're looking for. Watch out, yep. left and right. Be careful, yep. this might be a... And for that's the one that took off for me initially. But, uh, I'm looking at the... We went up the satellites. The satellites. Vehicle secure. Yeah, see how I said it had blood the black roof? And the taped headlights? Yeah, vehicle secure. We got a plate. You might want to run this right quick. I can. Actually, do you want me to search this vehicle real quick? No, yeah. We're going to get it searched, processed, going to be impounded. I can, I can stay here with it if you want. No, we're gonna impound it. So search it at who was it was Astro driving it, right? So if it was Astro, just search it through actions at Astro. Then whenever it's yeah. done, say that it's been towed. It's gonna be a Class C tow. It's gonna be a thousand dollar fine to get it out, and it's gonna be held, and nobody can get it out. So he cannot use it. Forty two twenty. I'll be primary. It's gonna be a banana lifeguard uh, SUV. Gonna be taking off road. Rides. Marina Drive eastbound. Eastbound ten four. Hey, so eastbound. Okay. I Eastbound can, Marina Drive. I'm going to be intercepted on Marina. I just turned on Marina passing the Sandys. And where we are passing Ace Liquor, still Eastbound Marina. Be coming up on you pretty quick. Making a right Panorama Drive. Southbound Panorama. Oncoming lanes. Making the left Zancudo Avenue. Eastbound Zancudo behind the Sheriff's Office. I'm trying to intercept. Let me know what, where it goes. Making a right through the Chinese buffet parking lot. Cutting left. Alhambra, making the left. Again, making the left again. Gonna be Zancudo West, making the left again through the Chinese parking lot again. Making the left again, Alhambra. Making the left nice again. Color. Making a right. No, Zancudo no, eastbound. Right making, continuing across the berm, Zancudo. Oh, I just saw that. 
You're gonna be, be taking burn. the dirt road, taking the dirt, or the dirt road, taking Smeb the dirt towards to the Joshua. berm. I'm gonna be secondary. He now is running opponents. lights and sirens. Simple. Let me turn over some calls. We're gonna be uh, eastbound on Joshua coming out 13. Oh, AI. Okay, well, I'm gonna be taking a pit timer left started. on CV, uh, pit time or pits, uh, um, at discretion of highest ranking, uh, trooper on duty, or officer, whoever. So, so what's your rank? I just, I just I'm in I'm media, so it's different, but I just say, um, we'll that's, just, that'd we'll be me then. I'm, oh, yeah, we're that's, that, I'm, I'm a sergeant, so that'd be me. Shots, oh, fired. shots fired. Shots Negative fired. You, you stay primary, you got bulletproof windows. I, I got a bullet for one shield. Yeah, one of those. One shield, I don't know. going to be taking a left, going to be on standby. Going to be turning on Union left, going to be coming out on 13 on the Union exit. Why is if that deputy gets up on us, if he goes around the taking corner, I'm going to Taking a right, him. northbound, yeah, 13, going to be in the primary lane of travel, passing on the shore. You're going to pit your deputy. We're going to be t flipping around, watch out inside. We're going to be southbound, southbound lanes, he's slowing down. And for as soon as I can get up, I'm passing again. Gonna be going off road. Gonna be Union again. Now on the Grapeseed side. Gonna be taking a left. Going to be southbound on Neilway, or sorry, westbound on Neilway. Looks like he's still pointing something. And for back, back off, back off. Taking a right. Gonna be keep eyes, but back off. Negative left on a dirt road. Here, let me let me buy let me buy on your left. Oh Jesus, he's oh, going up there. I, I would suggest not following. But okay. Keep updates on if his Tahoe. Can, if his Tahoe can make it, mine can. We're still continuing on the dirt road <laughs> northbound. My Tahoe's a little bit lifted with off-road tires. His go. doesn't. Still so if he can make it, I can. Uh, making a left westbound now. He's coming back through the field uh, by the by that barn. Coming back towards the airfield. Towards the airfield. Going to be at the uh, dirt road that parallels the end of the airfield, heading southbound, heading back towards Seaview. Maybe something. Coming through the barns at Seaview, making a left northwestbound or southwestbound Seaview. Passing McKenzie's airfield, he's now running lights and sirens. I got eyes. Be secondary. Protecting from call, it's going to Seaview, uh, southeastbound. Taking a uh, negative. Look like he was turning. <gasps> We're good. Passing the fruit stand, still continuing. I got it. Ten ten. Gonna be off roading. Uh, just took before the how uh, the buildings on Sea View. Gonna be gonna be westbound on the beach now behind these houses. Gonna be yeah on the beach. He's freaking life patrolling the beach as well in the freaking pursuit. Still gonna be westbound on the beach. Uh, Smith, we can get you uh, come out on the marina. We're gonna be on the berm, out in the water. Uh, light pit, yeah, it's a good time for a pit. Good time for a pit. So if we can box them in. We're gonna be uh, on the uh, kind of mud area over here, just over the berm. Yep, see if we can here and get them boxed. Oh, be careful, be careful, be careful. Oh, he just minor 1050. We're gonna be coming back. On the uh, boat ramp, can have him boxed in. Try to at least. Still gonna be trying to pit him. Gonna be fail. Oh, you just popped in front of him. Then, uh, fire rifle, arm, rifle, fire rifle, rifle, rifle. Shots fired. Shots fired. Oh. Shots fired, I got one down. We got an officer down too. I need my other unit. I got one suspect down, one officer down. Ben 4 I'm gonna be 23 and scene, just arrived. Let me secure my rifle. Oh, fuck. He's dead, dude. Should we get a body bag out here? Uh, I got a white sheet over here. I'm bringing it to you right now. See, the thing is, he I saw the rifle. 
my fucking truck wouldn't get enough grip, I'd fucking, after he shot the fucking trooper, I hit him with the Tahoe, and he went up over my hood, was yeah. incapacitated enough that I can get out and fucking shoot him. I yeah, emptied well, I'm gonna, seven or eight rounds into his fucking the, face. Um, the cameras on the... Mm. Secure the deputy's firearm before the coroner gets here, please. Or the trooper's firearm. You say this isn't a deputy? Secure his firearm and all of his gear. Um, okay, 422 to um, all units. We've got a 911 call. Um, we need all units. It's going to be um, Sandy Shores Beach. Um, s someone has been kidnapped, and What's that? Um, Great. there's a metal rod through the person's leg. Um, We've just been yeah, so the person's, time. That's probably what it is. person's been kidnapped. Go ahead and show code 3. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm already here. Um, okay, yeah, I have eyes. Have one for me. I think it's gonna be a boat. I have a tugboat watch in watch the watch water watch. right now. I have eyes on a tugboat. Um, I think this might be the tugboat that we're looking for. I'm gonna go ahead and call in um, county, water, county, uh, whatever that would be called. I forgot. Uh, I don't know. It's gonna be. Oh, I've got eyes on the suspect. I've got eyes on the suspect. It's gonna be. Um, it's gonna be like the. Uh, shoot, I don't even know. It's right. We're right. So if you look at the He's tattoo the... shop, we're gonna be right behind the tattoo shop, all the way down to the beach. We got. We got a suspect. Um, I see your boat. I'm running to the suspect right now. I see the tugboat. Oh, you no, stupid! One. Saw that happen in real time. Go to priority one. We got says we got. I'm gonna roll EMS here in a second. Hang on. I'm going. With, I'm going to priority one. I have eyes on him. Where's he at? Oh, I see him. They're down here. Yep, just coming out, and then they're on the beach. We'll take our vehicles down there. We're in co we're in a good county met out here really fast. All right, so just hang on. Give me one second. All right. Are you um? All right. Just keep talking I've to me. Been um, are you? I've been I was fishing, and they told me to come on their tugboat, okay. and I went on, the guy started talking random country, country gibberish, uh, where the, um, typical Russian, that motherfucker right there! What? Yeah, that boat is on the move. Okay, yeah, um, that motherfucker oh shit, right I there. didn't do that, sorry. He stole um, my bottle of vodka, then shoved it up my own ass! Okay, and you sure of this? We can go investigate, but we're not sure if... They oh, kidnapped me, person. tied my okay, mouth yeah. shut, yeah, and chilled the metal boat leg the boat. to my Guys, pin rod. The boat. A, already got yes, a boat I'm pretty right fucking sure. I got a speedboat coming out there as well. I don't know if that's a 78, but... You need me to drive? Stay patrol, identify yourself. Get back or I'll blow the boat up. Just step back, step back, step back, get back, get back reverse, reverse, get reverse. Get back, I will blow this motherfucker up. Reverse, 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 reverse. What are you doing? Reverse. I think my boat operator might be 10 7. Bryson, reverse. I got eyes on him. He's on the front over there. He's got looks like he's got a long rifle in. I have no cover here. Two twelve. Uh, we got one at gunpoint. He's sorry. I had a phone call. <laughs> Beep. Who is this? Is this an AI? No, that's okay. Two and a go away. Shoot. Yeah, give me where there's no cover. That's why. Shots fired. He's... Oh, I'm hopping off the boat. <laughs> I'm hit. I'm hit. I have no cover on this thing. He's on the left side back there. Yeah, stay away from that. We won't shoot each other. Holy! Oh shit! Oh! He's dead. 
Explosions. I think you might have hit one of those things. Yep, that They're whole boat is, is not dead. Realistic. I'm hit too in my vest. No, I, I don't know well. how it said you killed me. I, I, I pressed the button. I think <laughs> I, I pressed I, the button. I don't know. I'm moving in. <laughs> Greasy, you gotta tell me that was on recording. No, oh, I've got it, yeah. Oh, thank lord. Can you get me closer? I'm gonna try to, I'm gonna try to board. I wouldn't board. Step control. I really wouldn't board a boat. Uh, 422 what dispatch, I'm gonna be attempting to, uh, I'm gonna be coming that way. I got way him over here. He's freaking Muhammad over here. <laughs> Hear me down. <laughs> I'm gonna secure him. Right, I got another boat. I'm gonna secure him. 